quick video regarding uh, overclocking your HEC Thunderbolt. Like the guys who came up in the blogs and forums, you can actually overclock your HEC Thunderbolt surpass 2 GHz. It's really hard to do. There's pretty much a lot of kernels going out there. But the most popular ones are on XDA developers website, which I'll provide a link below down there. Um, I tried about every single one. Every single one is not stable. It will lock up on your screen or booting screen. It will just lock up. Some people think that when it happens, you actually break your phone. It's not true. But um, I'm running pretty much 1.4 gigahertz. It's pretty much the only hertz you can run at without locking up your phone. Uh, I just want to show you on the set CPU. Let's see, 1.408. That's the maximum I can get. I did. This is unfortunate, but I did get to actually 1.9. It was running very well for like a minute. And I did a quadrant score and I got like 2700 score. But after that, it just locked up on me. And after that, I tried to keep doing that and getting the quadrant score. But every time I ran the quadrant score, it would just crash. So it wouldn't even let me continue the quadrant score. But like I'm saying, it seems like the only stable megahertz you can run at right now is uh, 1.4. There are kernels running 1.92, but they're not stable for everyone. On the site, it tells you it's not stable for every single person who owns an HTC Thunderbolt. I tried it a few times, and it kept locking up on me. But if you want to, guys, want to try it out, go to the link below. Just remember, I'm not responsible for anyone who breaks their phone. I just want to let you know about that. I am not responsible, so uh, don't come at me and try to sue me or something. It's, it's really, I'm not responsible for it. You do run smoothly on 1.4. That's pretty good. It's really quick and snappy. You can see it's pretty much instant what you do. You click anything, it, it opens instantly without without hesitation. It's just really quick. Um, you can also, if you guys are new to uh, overclocking, and if you don't know what set CPU is, it's pretty much essentially controls the speed of your processor. Uh, you can also go into advanced and set your voltages and everything, but I do not recommend to play your voltages if you don't know what you're doing, because you could also lock up your screen. And if you don't know anything about fixing that, you think that you broke your phone, but you actually haven't. I recommend to keep your phone at 1.4 GHz right now. All the kernels out there right now really aren't that stable, so I would wait. But until then guys, just uh, leave some feedback on my page, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and uh, peace.